A while ago, Adobe had a really promising voice manipulation software in the making, and it was definitely way ahead of its time. Just take a look at this. And uh, uh, I kissed my dogs and my wife. OK. So let's, uh, let's do something here. OK. Copy, paste. Let's do it. Copy, paste. Oh, yeah, it's done. Let's listen to it. And uh, uh, I kissed my wife and my wife. Oops. But for some odd reason, there were no official news releases or even announcements made after this extremely concerning public reveal. Fast forward to now, you are listening to a video that's entirely made from AI vocal synthesis. For reference, this is my normal voice. The AI simply cloned my voice by training with my audios and transcripts from a few of my older videos. And now, this AI can actually speak normally and even sing for me, which would typically be impossible to achieve. I can become an NM. Some Maluma to Maluma, you assuming I'm a human, all I gotta do to get a 3D US over human innovative and I made a problem so that anything he says is ricocheting of amenable to you. And at the same time, I've demonstrating him to give a mother of a card. He's feeling like it's of a dating, never evading, and I know the haters are forever waiting for the day that they can they fell off to be celebrated because another way you get a motivated, make elevated music. You make elevated music. Sing some slick Japanese. Menoma enoto birao aketara harukaze. Torita chi mo kiki demachia wase. Or just be some dumb copy pasta. What the f did you just f***ing say about me, you little bitch? Which is also pretty fun and scary at the same time. And these are all done through this research paper called TalkNet. TalkNet came out in mid-2020 and it is able to reproduce singing by mimicking tones from another person with a reference audio. While it can still perform without a reference audio too, but it doesn't sound so good. So my AI vocal cord is capable of singing without damaging any ears now. But this singing thing isn't perfect either. Notably when some part of the singing that requires dragging on vocals. Do me donne, donne you, donne, not know you. My voice goes everywhere. This could be because there isn't any singing in the data set or just simply because the audio reference for the AI to copy the style of was not clean enough and don't have enough training data. So just imagine how well if we have a really well-trained AI model, it would be crazy. I definitely struggle the most when it comes to making the AI pronounce well or drag on will. This is because the current AI talking net uses a type of pronouncing notation called RPuppet. Our puppet is a set of phonetic transcription codes so it tells you how an English word is spoken in American English. Since this AI model is trained in English, as long as I make the R puppet similar to the pronunciation of other languages, I can make the AI sing in Japanese too. So this is how Harumachi is possible. This actually also applies to singing as some syllables are separated instead of spoken like a word. So you will see some really odd combination of inputs to produce the actual singing like pronunciation oh, you can see in the comparison here. And yes, I'm dropping my first ever song covered by my AI vocal cord. Check out the full song link in the description. I'll also put the input lyrics in the actual lyrics side by side too as it is sometimes really funny what input I choose in order to get the AI to sing some words accurately. Well, these voice cloning AIs were already really believable if you played it through a phone call a few years ago. Having this clear audio is definitely going to break the internet and it can definitely be clearer than what you are hearing right now. So I'm pretty worried for my grandparents. Meanwhile, singing still has a long way to go. Due to some actual ethical concerns with the peers I collaborated with for this video. I would not be publicly teaching people how to use this AI, but shout out to Justin John for helping me with making this video and if you really want to learn it, you can join my discord and ask there. On the other hand, as of September 9th, Facebook AI just released a jaw-dropping speech synthesis AI that does not require a transcript to train and it sounds even more real than this current voice. It has some really impressive results, but the codes are not released yet. Here, have a listen. When an aristocracy carries on the public affairs, it's verification there may be in science. And from the last video, I talked about how you can deep fake videos in real time, and it has definitely troubled a lot of people, even though the current voice cloning can really perform live. But if you look closely at the Adobe video, it's literally a real time voice editing demo performed on a stage in 2016. 2016 is 5 years ago, by the way, let that sink in. 
it's literally way ahead of its time. But let's not fear the technology, instead we should be prepared and strengthened against it early on. Because the future will always inevitably come and sometimes there is no point struggling against it. So if you want to learn more about AI, Today's sponsor Skillshare has the right place for you. Skillshare is an online learning community with thousands of inspiring classes for creators. You can freely explore new skills, deepen existing passions, and have fun with your creativity. Right now, you probably have a lot of questions on what exactly is AI, machine learning, or whatever this mystical and futuristic technology is. If you're not, there is actually this class called Demystifying Artificial Intelligence, Understanding Machine Learning by Christian Howman, which provides a really great introduction on the topic of AI. The lessons aren't that long either, so you can easily go through them during your free time. What's even better is that they are currently also providing a limited time offer of one month free premium trial instead of the usual two weeks, which provides you plenty of time to go through these short lessons. And even if you are done with that class, you can also check out their other more in-depth machine learning and AI courses or other amazing ad free and high quality creative classes like uh, photography, illustrations, and video editing. The first 1,000 people to click the link in the description will get a one-month free trial of Skillshare so you can start exploring your creativity today. Lastly, thank you for watching. A big shout out to Andrew and many other Patreons and members that support my work through Patreon and YouTube. If you have any questions, feel free to join my Discord too. Follow my Twitter if you haven't and I'll see you all in the next one.